and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is probably the most highly requested video on this channel and it is of course as you saw from the title my entire Juicy Couture bag collection. <gasps> it's a big one. You guys I love collecting juicy bags and I have a very big collection so since this video has been so highly requested i thought it'd be really fun to take you guys through what bags i own and talk and touch on what bags i'm looking for and just show you my collection as a whole i will not be including clothing or purses and wallets as this is just purely a bag collection so if that's something you think you will like and enjoy and if you like the pink girly juicy vibes then you'll like it around here for sure so be sure to subscribe and like and press the bell notification to be notified every time i post a video just like this one and don't forget to share this video to your friends or a fellow juicy girly lover i am very aware this is a fairly big collection but i'm doing this for entertainment purposes only and to show you guys what i have so let's get into the video okay girlies here is the full collection as an overview i'm going to go through each bag one by one but it will be quite speedy because i have so many but if there are any bags in particular you'd like me to go into in more detail then just let me know down below and i can do a dedicated video to those bags i think the only right way to get through this absolute tower and mountain of juicy bags is to start with the smallest and move our way up to the biggest bags as the biggest bags are of course at the back so let's begin so my actual smallest juicy bag i would say is this one that i'll pop on the screen i do own this bag but unfortunately she is not in my wardrobe right now so i'll pop her up on the screen but she's super cute she's my first ever juicy bag i purchased from tk maxx and she's a nice pink and brown and then the second ever juicy bag I purchased was this one. She is stunning. Of course, any bag charms on the bags will be from my shop, my Etsy shop, Charms by Odette. So Odette is my charms brand and all the information will be in the description below, but also in the bio of my channel. But this is just a most beautiful icy blue velour bag with the diamantes. This is my only bag with the rhinestones on it that says juicy. So I definitely love her. This bag charm goes so well as this is like a winter bag to me. She is stuffed inside right now, but she does have the iconic juicy logo. But yeah, all around, I love this bag, but I definitely wear it more in the winter because of the colour. And here are the straps at the top she is stunning okay next let's do my barrel bags so i do in fact have a free juicy barrel bags i'm going to start with the order that i purchased them in so this is the heritage collection juicy couture barrel bag she is stunning i love this bag so much the light like suede velory fabric with the pink is just stunning like this collection was like my dream collection with the pink on the handle it is just perfection and i did add this little hair bow onto the bag so i thought that would be super cute and the crowns remind me of juicy here is the zip you guys all my bags will be stuffed like with just random stuff to keep their shape so this one's just stuffed with some bags but again the inside has the logo and some inside pockets I do have the most bags in this colourway as it is my favourite collection so far to date that Juicy has done. But yeah, this is probably, dare I say, my favourite barrel bag. I then purchased this bag. Now this is from the American Juicy collection. So I did have to buy this online to get it shipped over to the UK. But I love this bag. I love the cafe brown. I think it's called with the pink. It's stunning. The diamantes on the zip. It's just the cutest thing. And I paired it with this Odette bag charm, which is just stunning because it matches like the diamante vibes. Again, this one just come with a long strap, but I just love the fact that it's gold hardware. Like I'm such a gold girly. Here is the strap. She's really cute. She's actually the cutest juicy strap I've ever seen. But I just keep the strap inside the bag as I'm not the biggest crossbody wearer. But yeah, this bag is absolutely stunning. Cost me a pretty penny, but she was definitely worth it. And 
Then my final barrel bag, which is actually my most recent juicy purchase, is this one, which is from the Daydreamer collection, like print, but they put it into a barrel bag and I love this bag with the studding and it matches my Daydreamer perfectly. I will show you that together later when we look at the Daydreamers, but yeah, this is the pink daydreamer colorway on the barrel bag and she's just the cutest i love the structure of this strap and how it really holds itself up and of course the heart and lock keychain is just the cutest the zip has the j and inside she is stuffed but this one does have a dark red pinky interior and this one i picked up from tk maxx it was about 30 pounds i believe moving on to more of like the vanity makeup bags i did purchase this one first this is from canada i got it on depop for a really good price i paid around 20 or 30 pounds and it has the juicy heart zip and the diamantes i lied i do have the juicy and the diamonds on this bag but it is a makeup bag which is what i use it for so it is slightly different and because this bag is a travel bag it did come with this bottle i did rhinestone it myself but it was just a normal pink originally and so yeah i love that they come with these bottles because they're so fun to diy and custom and have in your collection and this one I always have on my shelf. She's just the most perfect shade of pink. Here is the inside and I keep her well stuffed for shape. Okay, then next up is my Heritage Makeup Vanity Case. This is stunning with the diamantes. And the logo is so cute if you can see that printed on there. This one does scare me because it is very fragile if you feel it up close but for it to be on display it is perfect i love the pink and brown combo and the top handle the zips do say juicy couture and again similar inside to the previous one i do keep this one stuffed as well I also picked this one up from America and it does come with the same bottle, which I rhinestoned also. But yeah, I paid for this one through eBay. <laughs> Moving on, I do have this bag. This was my first ever bag bought directly from the Juicy website. My boyfriend bought it for me. It is this pink and white monogram bag. That just says juicy all around it she is well over like a year and a half old now so she is showing some signs of wear near the top because of like makeup and stuff i try to keep her in the best condition possible she does come with the j zip and the juicy couture this bag is silver hardware which is quite common in the uk with their juicy bags so i decorated her with silver accessories again another crown <laughs> inside this one it just says juicy on the black tag this was before they come out with like the heritage inside of the uk and inside i just have female products but yeah she is perfect and so so cute she's the perfect size to carry for out and about everyday purposes and here is the handle moving on to my final american bag i swear this is the last guys i also purchased this from america through ebay i had to have it in my collection because the rhinestones and the pink and brown colorway i do have this christmas odette bag charm which again link in the description if you want to purchase for the christmas period i think it goes so lovely on this bag and all the bag charms do have a heart clasp, which actually does match the ones Juicy uses on their bags now. So it does look like a really good match. But yeah, this one is stunning. She's actually very heavy with whatever I have stuffed her with. But yeah, this one is lovely with the pink and this does come on the bag when you buy it. This zip does just say Juicy Couture. I have stuffed her to the brim with cloves, apparently, to keep her shape. If you can see inside, it's just the American Juicy tag. <laughs> you guys, let me know in the description below if you stuff your bags with cloves too. But I have to stuff my bags to keep their shape. But yeah, she's definitely one of my favourites. She is just so stunning and always a people pleaser. Like, the crowd loves her. <laughs>
Okay, next let's do my pumpkin bags. I did actually purchase the black first as I was lucky enough to find this in TK Maxx. Believe it or not, she was the final one left and she is so cute. I love this shape. This before I purchased my daydreamers was the closest shape I had to a daydreamer. And I just absolutely love the size and the shape of this bag. Inside, surprisingly, this one is not stuffed, but this is what the inside looks like. And it does come with the pouch with the J for smaller items. I honestly felt like I struck gold when I found this bag and I just love her so much. And I'm so glad I made her the pink and black vibe as she looks super cute. And this, I believe, was £40. I then searched and searched but could not find the pink anywhere so I decided to buy her online for resale and I found her for a really good price. She was 30 or £40 pounds for the same price that you'd find her in TK Maxx. The only thing is that she didn't come with the keychain so my boyfriend actually bought me this one from the Juicy website and it is stunning. I actually prefer this one and it also did not come with the inside pouch so I just bought this one from Sheen with the bunnies and attached it to the inside little ring so i can still have a smaller pouch for my smaller pieces but yeah i love this one she did come with a small stain but i managed to get it off with my cellar water as that does work lovely if you ever get a stain on these i added these as i love the crowns it just reminds me of juicy so much and the logo is just stunning I do keep this one stuffed as I don't have it on a shelf, but it's just with the original packaging and here is the logo again. This has to be one of my favourites. The pink and the cream is just to die for and the fact that this like, is so shiny with the crowns is just, oh, this one does something to me. <laughs> Okay guys, we are definitely getting bigger in size now. This bag is my only vintage juicy bag. I found this on Vinted for £150 and I managed to get it down to like £120 and I love this bag. There's barely any damage or signs of wear on the straps considering its age. Like they are slightly wrinkled but they're not peeling just yet. I try to keep her in the best shape possible. I added a little bag charm onto here that I made from Odette to make her all cute and add to the aesthetic. But this one does say preppy royalty juicy and the shade of the pinky purple with the gold is just stunning like you guys know i love a pink and gold moment here is the back the bottom is also looking pretty good as well i love the hearts and here is the j zip but yeah you guys this bag is stunning i love her so much i'm so glad i found her this one is again stuffed but the inside does have the original logo it has the same pattern as the vintage ones and the inside is in basically immaculate condition. The only thing that wasn't was the J Heart mirror, which I just removed. But the inside is literally perfect, you guys. It has all the tags and everything. So I'm so glad I picked her up. It just feels nice to know that like not everyone has this one and it is hard to find and is rare and vintage and for such good condition, I know that she's definitely holding her value which is not the reason i buy my juicy bags of course but it's always nice to know that i do have a rare vintage bag that is in really good condition i really do look after her so yeah i love this one so much it is so me i'm struggling to show this one because it is not stuffed and it is a tote bag so it's more on the floppier side but i did find both of these bags on the same day i got so lucky I had both in my hands and another girl picked up the black and pink as well, like the only two that was left. And she said to me, I don't know which ones to get. And I was like, neither do I. And she said, oh, I'm just, I'm just going to get the black. And I saw her in the queue and she put the pink back and someone else picked it up. But I actually took the plunge and got both. They cost £40, so for two it did cost 80 but I'm so thankful I did because these bags are so hot online now and I know I would have regretted it and I would have had to pay resale. But here she is close up. Of course, I added the ribbons and accessories myself, but this bag is stunning. Inside, I do have some random things, so I'm just going to show you this, but of course, it has the logo and the zip and, of course, the coin pouch. You do have the main compartment with the zip, but both the sides actually pop open and have extra storage so this bag is absolutely huge but you wouldn't necessarily know it from the shape and what it looks like but yeah she is stunning 
Next up, we have the pink. So I do have a couple of accessories on here. My coin pouch makes it super heavy. I have a pom-pom. It does come with this heart, and I did add some charms to it. But this, go the pink and the cream, stunning. I love this bag. It's obviously, like I said, the exact same as the previous one. It does have the silver hardware. Again, the inside is the same and it does come with the coin pouch, which is super cute with the cream. I don't think I've got anything in this right now. Nope. It does have the inside pocket and again, this zips up and then both the sides un pop for more storage. These bags are perfect. Like they are just so good for like not only every day, but if you need a bigger bag. Like if you're going to the cinema, this is the bag you take. <laughs> you can fit so much in there. This collection this colorway is just my dream it's so beautiful like how could this not be everything you've ever dreamed of <laughs> it's so so cute now you guys it is time to move on to my daydreamers you guys have seen these tans on this channel because they are new and my new babies so with these again i did buy all three at the same time so let's go through them one by one starting off with the beautiful pink we have the heart clasp and charm and we have the key and the heart this one is obviously a daydreamer so they have the ribbon that threads all the way through i did scrunch the bag to give it more of this shape rather than the boxy shape that they come with i do keep this bag stuffed in its original packaging it doesn't mean i don't use it you guys it's just like i don't want these to get damaged as if you know me daydreamers have always been my dream and the fact that i even own them is a big deal and these cost me a pretty penny as they were from the juicy website and each bag was around 150 pounds so you can imagine why i keep these in the way i do but she is so cute and then it's going to be hard to show because i've got the dust bag and everything but if you guys want to see inside in more detail then check my finding my dream juicy daydreamer bag video as i do an in-depth tour but it does have the original interior as the old vintage juicy daydreamer bags including like the shop and the tag and everything it's just so cute and she is my autumn pink i love that they did this kind of dusty muted pink shade as it is a very autumnal color to wear but you guys breaking news they are releasing if it hasn't i don't know when this video is going out but they have just opened a juicy store in stratford westfield and let's just say it's been rumored that they're selling this bag on screen now which is in a glass case in their store someone dm'd them i can't remember who it was on tiktok but if i find her out, i'll put it in the description she dm'd them and said are you going to be selling this and they said yes soon so we're going to try and get our hands on that pink because what a beautiful bag but until then we have these three bags and honestly i don't know if my bank account can take another daydreamer right now so <laughs> But yeah, this one is probably my favourite out of the three because she is just so cute and, of course, pink. And I love this bit of the pink. Next, sticking to pink vibes, I do have the dark red and pink daydreamer as well. I was so fortunate to get these bags, you guys, and I'm so thankful I was able to. Like I said, it costs a lot, but these bags mean literally everything to me. So it is basically the exact same as the previous bag with the logo and the velour and the ribbon all the way around with the side pocket just in a different colourway. So yeah, the inside is all the same, but she is absolutely stunning. I love this one. I think it's such a unique colourway with the red and pink. And then we have the chocolate brown with the gold, which is stunning. I did not pick up the grey and black one because first of all it's silver hardware which I don't love and I don't need another black bag like you guys have seen I've got plenty of black juicy bags and in the daydreamer I feel like it's all about colour and that's what I was after so I chose to leave that one because obviously I don't need that one I don't need all four I was stuck between these three and I was going to sell one and I just haven't because I love them so much but maybe I will let go of one one day but for now these three are definitely staying but this is so cute this one with the gold it is so nice the embroidery and the ribbon again is just to die for and this one is just a black 
J on the back and again the inside is the same across all three bags so if you're interested definitely check out the video dedicated to the daydreamers I'll pop it on the screen so you can tap away and look at that video after this one because I really do go into in depth on how I found them the prices the quality the interior but yeah I cannot believe I own a daydreamer let alone three so very fortunate and I love these so much Whew, guys this is a long video but we are almost there stay strong we have three bags remaining the first travel duffel bag i own you guys have seen this bag in my what's in my bag it does have the same heart and key lock and the studded detail and this one is a pv pink is what the tag described it as it does have these handles and it has a little Popper to keep them together perfect for travel the zips have the j's and i also do really like the bottom of these ones it has the feet with the j on them so they won't get dirty if you stand it down like on the floor or somewhere here is the inside of this bag she is kept in well condition being stuffed with the logo at the back there and she does come with another small pouch i do love this bag so much and she is so beautiful to look at but she's very big in size and i do have three travel juicy bags i don't think i need all three and this one i just haven't been using as much as i thought i would so i am contemplating letting her go and selling her on to a different home which is so sad but you guys have seen my collection it is huge and this bag does take up a lot of space but she's a perfect travel bag so i was very happy with her but then i found this one i found this blue juicy couture travel bag and i loved this so much of course i still do with the silver jays this is just perfect size for a travel bag but if you guys watch my vlogs you would know i then went to london and found the pink she is so cute she's not stuffed right now so she's looking a little odd but the juicy is so cute it's giving barbie and the little clip i added makes her so adorable so when i found this new bag the plan was is this is the one that my boyfriend would use i said as a joke and my boyfriend loved the idea and if you've watched our anniversary vlog he takes this one and i take this one so we're matching <laughs> in style when we travel and they're just so cute so where i've got these two that match i don't feel like i need the previous bag i showed you guys let me know if you think i should sell her but they do come with the j and inside i've got a lot of stuff in here i've got my juicy couture little travel case which i haven't showed you guys but she is just my travel case she's like a toweling material it says juicy on the handle and she just has tons of compartments inside and has the j inside and there's so much stuff in here because we use these bags all the time but yeah you guys let me know if you think i should let her go as i loved her because she was a pink travel bag but now that i found the barbie one i don't feel like i'm gonna use her as much okay girlies i now have an absolute mess of a room but that was all of my juicy bags in my juicy couture collection currently today <laughs> as far as bags i'm on the lookout for obviously i want to try to get my hands on that new pink juicy daydreamer when it comes out and i do absolutely love this collection i think it's called precious moments of the american bags that they've received i also love the fluffy collection they had but i can't keep buying juicy bags from america it is very expensive i just have to hope and pray that they will reach the uk just like americans hope and pray that the uk juicy reaches them as well i hope you dolls enjoyed i hope it was interesting and fun to actually have a close look at all the bags i own if you do have a favorite let me know down below which one it is and which one you are on the lookout or on the hunt for next I have tried to take a little bit of a break from juicy couture hunting as I do just own so many bags. So I'm trying to buy ones that just are really special and I really, really want. So I think that's reflected in my collection. You can definitely see my aesthetic and what I enjoy through the bags that I do have and have kept to date. These bags will be in my collection forever, literally forever. I love the juicy bags so much and I'm just building up a collection like people do with 
my china with stamps with postcards it, if it makes you happy if it brings you joy then you do you girl thank you so much for watching as always and for all your love and support on this channel i love each and every single one of you dolls if you did enjoy this video please like comment and subscribe down below and tap the bell to be notified every time i post another video and i'll see you in my next video love you bye